Nothing symbolizes the ancient Egyptian civilization like papyrus. The plant was used to make paper throughout the Mediterranean. Writer and ecologist John Gaudet says ancient scholars considered it the wonder of the age. The Egyptian civilization, he adds, might not have developed without papyrus. They used to use papyrus boats. Then they found they could also use the boats to build the houses on. They didn't have to build a house on land. They could build it on water. All right. And then they found they could do all kinds of things with papyrus, as you can imagine. You can make baskets out of it. You can make sandals. You can make rope. But over the centuries, as papyrus swamps were drained for farmland or housing, an incredible natural resource was lost. In addition to the variety of items made from the plants, the swamps provided habitat for birds and fish and helped control pollution. They can actually filter sewage. And, Gaudette notes, as fresh water becomes scarcer, papyrus swamps can help preserve that resource. The water seeps into the soil and therefore it recharges the system underground that you don't see. And also, the papyrus, because the heads close over and form this canopy, and it creates this very humid barrier underneath, uh, it's great because it actually prevents water from being lost. So it's better to have papyrus than to have an open surface, like a reservoir. With his book, Papyrus, Ecologist John Gaudet hopes to raise awareness about this ancient plant and how it can benefit today's ecosystem and local economies. And he's optimistic that papyrus will once again flourish in the land it once ruled. For writer Faisa El Masri, I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News.